Welcome back to Let's Play Aquaria. Um, let's go fight this crab. I'm Cambrian Man, and... Man, I don't remember this guy at all either. Hopefully we won't die too badly. He doesn't look too hard. No Lee. And uh, you, you'll notice I did switch out the, um, the blaster pet. Ah, oh, there he is. Um, I think the trick is to shoot him down here. Sure. Or maybe his eyes. Maybe I have to shoot his eyes and then... Yeah, it looks like that's the case. Yeah, shoot his eyes and then he'll probably flip over or something like that. Oh, okay, shoot his eyes and then shoot his joints. I get it. And then he'll probably turn into, you know, flip over. Because there's Cthulhu down at the bottom. Underneath him. Or perhaps a Mind Flare. Like I said, I've been playing D&D recently. Um, I never actually used to play D&D a whole lot. Um, I played in a third edition campaign pretty regularly. Um, and I, I always tried to play it in middle school, but uh, apparently I was not nerdy enough to actually play D&D. I don't even know what I get for killing this guy. Something cool, I hope. Ow. So... Yeah, I, I'm not even gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. I know you, I know you're thinking it, but I'm not gonna say what I'm doing right now. I'm not hitting his. You know, for, you know. Okay, now he's jumping. So can he? Can I get him to jump again? Yeah, there we go. Come on, jump. Um, I'm kind of glad to see that, um, yeah, speaking of middle school and all that, um, they're bringing back Dark Sun. And I, I don't know why, but something about Dark Sun always appealed to me. You know, it's this kind of ravaged desert world. Um, I never was fond of the aesthetic, really, like the, uh, the cold barbarian sort of thing. But, ah, there we go. Cthulhu on a crab is dead. Oh, cool. I don't know what that is, but it looks funny. Hey, I got an achievement. Rock crab rocked. Um, did I kill the mantis shrimp? I don't even remember. Alright, cool. Does this... Some costumes actually give you bonuses. This one might. I don't really remember. Let's see. Yes, extra defense. Um, it's not the best one. The best one comes a little bit later, and we'll definitely get that, because not only is it kind of adorable, but it... Oh, this one's kind of funny, too. But um, not only is it adorable, but it's actually really useful in later fights. But this isn't it. This one's okay. It's not bad. But it's not the best one, either. I think I use this one quite a bit, though. Did I already get the spiky... Pretty sure I did. Let's see. Uh, that's not it. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I did get the spike. The urchin armor. Um, urchin armor's not bad either. There is, of course, one other piece of uh, armor that uh, I will definitely find later. Yeah, once I get through the game, pretty much get to the end, I'm going to go back and show you where all the items are. Because um, unless they're kind of along the path of the game. Some of them are really far out there. No real sense going that far out, out of my way just to show you an item. Um, but definitely the useful ones I will show you before I go. And I think I have. If I haven't, it's because I honestly forgot about it. I have no idea what's over here. Let's go look at it since we've got about five minutes left on this video. So like I was saying before, I, yeah, I, I pick up threads of uh, conversations with myself, I guess, um, minutes after I, I started them. I, apparently, I wasn't nerdy enough to actually know anybody in middle school or high school who played D&D. So I, I never actually really got to play it. Um, 
but I've really been enjoying 4th edition. If you're somebody who likes games, like just generally likes you know, gaming, um, it's a great kind of streamlined um, entrance to it. Yeah, I can see why it would be divisive, but you know, frankly, who cares? Uh, I'm trying to remember how the, the pull form, the, the, the pull, uh, here we go, bind, what is bind? There we go. Yay, okay. I don't think I actually need it, but um, yeah, it's very streamlined, and it is in a lot of ways more video gamey. But I kind of like that. I like that it it kind of splits the uh, the the kind of game mechanics and the role playing mechanics up. You can still role play. You can still role play as much as you want, but um, it's not really a mechanics based role playing. You know, it's not somebody saying this is what your character can do, this is what they can't do, and stuff like that. Secret passage. I think you, yeah, you have to be in the life form to see these things. So there's an item. There's a dude kind of uh, walking like an Egyptian. Yeah. Most of these don't do anything. I think I may have said that before, but most don't do anything. A few actually are kind of mechanically useful. Um, I like to collect them all just because. I don't even know if I can go this way. Uh, apparently I can. I can sneak under his butt. So yeah, light form is not necessary because you have I have the um I have the Dumbo octopus. It is, however, still useful. Yeah, I don't know where this leads either, but this is you know, this is why I love games like this, because I like exploring. I like finding these little little treasures and secrets. Oh, that's what's here. Nice. Okay, cool. Um, let's see if there's anything else around here. Sunlight, and it doesn't actually do anything. But, yeah. So, let's see. Should I go back? I don't actually want to go back from here. I want to go this way and maybe go down. Let's see if I can get there in two, two and a half minutes. Um, so, like I was, oh, there we go, um, I think I just put him away, I didn't actually take him out, there we go, um, so yeah, give D&D &D a try, it's pretty fun, and I'm kind of surprised there haven't been any, uh, 4th edition video games yet, because it definitely mechanically lends itself to it, you know, if you're somebody who likes World of Warcraft, um, and a lot of aspects of it, but not the grind. It's it's good. Um, if you're somebody who likes, you know, kind of, I don't know, it, it's 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 a, a big improvement, I think. Um, and if you don't think it's a big improvement, you're free to play the old versions. Uh, I have a minute and a half. I don't think I'm going to get anywhere. I'm going to just save. I think we actually made some progress today. I'm surprised. I'm remembering this pretty well. So I'll see you next time on Let's Play Aquaria.